Hi, good morning friends. Now I am going to provide Jira tutorial. One of the important tool nowadays, every interview as a developer or create tester when you go for the interviews. So one of the mandatory thing where they are going to ask, do you know about the Jira? Do you know about the agile methodology? So these are the things that very commonly they are going to ask. So that this tutorial will help you to success to get success in the interview point of time. So I'm going to explain to you here about the agile entire process. Not only testing roles and responsibilities as a product owner, scrum master, QA team, scrum team, complete activities, end-to-end -end activities, which I am going to explain to you. So today in this first session, I'm going to give the introduction to Jira. Try to understand my here. Jira is a product of Atlassian, which is released in 2002. Jira present stable version is 8.8.0. In this tutorial, I'm taking the latest version of the Jira 8.8.0 so that it makes it easy to you to practice by installing Jira in our system. Jira is an agile project management tool that supports any agile methodology like Scrum and Kanban or any other. Jira is an agile project management tool. That means all the terminologies and components whichever they implemented in the agile we have the terminologies like Scrum, Sprint, like this. So these are all the keywords, basic components are implemented in this Jira. It is most suitable for the project management activities. So what type of Agile methodology we can use? In Agile, we have the different approaches. Scrum is there, Extreme Programming is there, Lean Development is there, Feature Driven Development is there, like this. Which one it is sort of any Agile methodology flavor you can use the Jira in your project and also Kanban also we can use it is. Jira can be used by agile team members like product owner, scrum master, developers as well as test engineers. That is, scrum team can use it, it is. Using Jira we can track the process of agile project like epics, user stories, task, sub-task and bugs, whether those are ready to do or those are in progress or those are completed. This process we can easily track when you go for the Jira. Using Jira, we can able to track the progress of current sprint to do. There are the three terminologies to do in process or in progress. Next one done so these are the three ways by seeing the jira once you open you can able to understand the current sprint which stage it is which activities are done which activities to be done which are in progress easily you can identify it is jira tool we can also use it for test management activities like you want to prepare test cases as you can able to prepare the test cases you can do review on test cases we can go for the test execution which includes a defect management like we can prioritize our defects, you can assign our defects, you can track our defects, you can report the bugs. These are the activities we can do, test management activities. But remember that Jira directly is not going to allow you to prepare the test cases. For this, we need some plugins are required for that, which I'm going to cover that for now. So which plugin is required to prepare test cases in Jira means Gpair is required. This plugin, with the help of this plugin, we can able to write the test cases. Right. I will show this one also in my sessions, how to use JPEG to prepare the test cases. Right. Then Jira supports different operating systems, Mac, Windows, Android, like this. So Jira is a web-based application with a three-tier architecture. So here, Jira, you want to work, you want to practice, two ways we can install this one here. The two instances are available for Jira. One is called cloud instance, other one is called server instance. 
what is this cloud instance no installation and maintenance required for this cloud instance in simple if you register the atlassian will host a jira application and they will give the permission to you to use the jira okay that is a cloud instance it is no need to in install this one no need of maintenance here but for practicing purpose a cloud instance is preferable i will explain it how to so cloud instance we have to use it is the other one server instance we need to install and run the jira product which is a little bit complex for us to do in our system you can directly download you can install we can use it is okay but generally this jira server software whichever is there which will be installed in the company server in our real time is in the company server they are going to install where administrator will create the users and they provide a url and login credentials for the agile team members in the real time means so you know that how the test environment is going to be there will be one server will be there which are the local systems the jira software will be installed here from there we can able to access we can go for the our day to day activities we can do in our jira okay now let us once again you see jira is a product of atlassian which is released in 2002 what is the present stable version 8.8.0 so it is more suitable for agile project management it can be scrum or kanban or any other agile related extreme programming lean development like this who can use this jira agile team members agile team members means you know that product owner scrum master developers test engineers what is the advantage of this one when you go for jira we can easily track the process of the agile project such as apex user stories tasks sub task and bugs so i am not explaining about this thing detail it is later in the course we are going to discuss what is apex what is user stories task sub task and bugs all things so we can not only this project management we can do the test management activities such as test cases preparation review on test cases test execution the you need to understand one point here project management means how the development activities are do taking for the project test management means how the testing activities are taking for the project there is a difference both we can able to do but whenever you want to do this test management activity such as test case preparation directly jira is not supporting for that we need some plugins for the jira that is called jpair plugin is required so that once you have this plugin it allows you to prepare test cases for execution we can track the bugs prioritize the bugs all things we can able to do it is so which os yes it supports the multiple operating systems so web based application with theater architecture so jira have the two types of instances for us cloud instance server instance cloud instance means it is very simple to use no of any installation no maintenance required atlassian will host jira application in the cloud for us so generally we prefer for practicing purpose so cloud instance then server instance we need to install and run jira product this also available you can download we can exe file are going to get, run it and you can use it is but it is a little bit complex installation if i go for the real time in company generally so which will be installed in the server machine so where administrator will going to create the login credentials for us and he is going to provide the jira url as well as login credentials so that we can able to work our day by day activities in our jira okay coming to the this course what i am going to cover to you try to understand one of the important thing where we are what topics are learning in jira so everything from the scratch to and i am going to end to end activities in jira what agile team is going to everything i am going to cover to you okay first sima here introduction to jira jira software setup how to install this one so like cloud instance you want to use or server instance you want to use both i will going to explain to you step by step i will explain 
then introduction to agile scrum methodology and the terminology in agile scrum without knowing this concept you are not able to work with agile so this is important you should have the vocabulary about the agile methodology if you understood that that makes easy to work in the jira we don't have this concept agile methodology concept it doesn't have working with jira is a complex that's the reason first time i'm going to explain to you all the vocabulary and the process of agile methodology so they are going to get the class such as apex story that's a user story task backlog refinement meeting or grooming of user stories how we can do it is sprint review sprint retrospective meeting scrum meeting story point velocity burn down and burn up charts these are the important terminology we have then what are the after that now we are going to work with the jira here from fourth point as a product owner what type of activities he can do in jira such as creating projects adding users so creating release versions creating epics creating user stories providing user story description these things after that scrum master activities like creating sprint adding user stories to sprint start sprint adding sub tasks to user stories these activities then we go for test management activities by qa test how to create the test cases in jira using jipper plugin jipper plugin creating test cycles then the thing but the test suite how to create then execution or update test case in jira so then creating bugs in jira then sprint life cycle complete the sprint not script here it is it is sprint it is complete sprint sprint reports once sprint is completed by default jira is going to create the reports to you like burn up charts burn down charts velocity charts the charts where you are going to see then i will give the what is difference between so agile scrum methodology to kanban methodology these two difference also we are going to discuss okay this is what i am going to cover to you in coming sessions also try to watch all the sessions so that you will get the complete idea about the jira it is not difficult it is very simple easy to work and installation also i'm going to explain to you detail by step by step thank you try to subscribe my channel for more videos